Hello everybody, it's me again, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. Wow, it has been way longer than I planned since I played this game. I'm so sorry. A lot of things just all of a sudden start happening at once with my jobs, and then uh, my mom had a melanoma spot on the back of her leg, so she had to have surgery on it, and she couldn't walk very well, so I dedicated the whole of last week to taking care of her. So I am really sorry about the wait between syndicate shenanigans, dead space, and this, but I feel like, I mean, I'm on night four, so I feel like I'm getting very, very close to the end of this game. So we're just going to go ahead and waste no more time and hop in right now. I am going to have to play through from the beginning of night four, I believe. Daddy, yeah. I'm going to have to redo all of night four, so I'll be back in just a second to right where we left off into the horror of being stuck in a spring lock suit. And, uh, yeah, Minorina's crawling up on me. Not fun. It doesn't help that it's tarantula season out right now. So having little tiny things crawling up me, not a fan. <laughs> happy days, happy days. Not. Also, I have coffee in a Disneyland mug Don't that I bought at Disneyland my last trip in I'm October. Going to hurt you. And a new phone case. I am only going to keep <laughs> because I'm an adult. <laughs> See, what is that blinking back there? Is that like an exit sign or something? It's because, dummy, this is the room where they use I want to think that's an exit sign, but I think it's not quite so hopeful. I want to think it's like the blinking eye of another animatronic back there somewhere, but I don't know. Or something? The scooper. It sounds like something you would use for ice cream. Well, of course, dummy. It sounds like... Abide! Come on! And commence loud noise. Yep, there it is. Ah, ha, ha, my airdrops! I can't wait to see the ending of this game. I have a feeling, and I've seen, I haven't watched any videos, of course, but I have seen certain things that link to, like, a, that hint to, like, a secret ending or something. There's something. So, I don't know. I might have to try that. that I've, do you ever play make-believe? Fuck me, I just spilled coffee in my lap. <laughs> and on my tablet! Oh, no! <gasps> when you are really the other. It's okay. Artie's fine. Zappity, zappity, zappity. Oh, that's so fucking creepy. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, AD. I'll open the face plates for you. That way they can hey! find you. Hey! Can I wind these yet? All you have to do is, is wait. wait. Not all. If only it were that easy. I'd recommend that you keep the come. spring locks wound up. You don't want them to get too loose. No, I I totally I get it. Thank you. I wonder if there's like an audio cue for the mini arenas or if I just have to look. Yeah, there you are, you little fucker. Okay. The next one should be on this side somewhere. I think. Yep, there you are. Hi. Okay. And the next one's going to try to crawl into my suit and that's as far as I've made it. So, yep. Hey, fucking bitch, fuck. You wanna... Hey! 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 What are you doing? Huh? Okay, where, 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 where? Oh, there you are, hi! No, 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 no! Wait a minute. I wiggled and it didn't do anything. But I, I, I wiggle! I, you, you obey the wiggle! Mini Rita, obey the wiggle! Fucking fuck. Okay. <laughs> I was also gonna make like a disclaimer about how I was gonna try and like not swear so much in my videos because I feel like I'm relying on it too much for the comedy. So, uh. And then I've already dropped that font like six times in this video. So I'm sorry. Open the face plates for you. So, for the one that climbs into my suit, do I just have to wiggle, 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 wiggle? Or am I like supposed to click on it? Am I supposed to not look at it? Am I supposed to be doing something else? Oh, there's another spring lock up there. Fuck you. Oh, that one was- oh, there's more up top. Okay. Maybe that's just what happens when I get the spring locks to let them go too loose. Instead of there being an actual like spring- whoa! Another spring lock malfunction animation? It's just kind of like, you know, it just- put a mini arena in your suit or something. I don't know. But I need to keep an eye on the right side of my screen in case that bitch decides to shut up. I had two of them just then. 
Okay, how do I avoid those? How? Because the wiggling isn't working. I wiggled. A lot wiggled. I'd recommend that you there keep you the spring lamps well. Norman, shut up! Wait, what's that back there behind you? Is that like Ballora Gallery? It, this is Ballora Gallery, isn't it? At the end of- it's gonna light up, isn't it? And something really, really spooky is gonna happen. Okay, 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 okay. I just need to- Whoa, he was fucking close. Okay, she, pardon me. I mean, there's nothing wrong with a man being about- What? 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 What am I supposed to do about that? Ah! Dismissive whore. Again with the swearing. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> I mean, in horror games, it's a lot harder. I'm sorry, because, you know, you just want to say whatever to make yourself feel better. Okay. Yep. I can't. I can't. I don't know what to do. Do I have to, like, ignore them? Literally. Like, not even look at them. Not even acknowledge they're there. Because, hello. I'm just gonna ignore you. Go up this way. Okay. I'm still alive. Get out of here. No, 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 I'm just gonna try and do that. I'm just gonna- Would you not get off?! Oh my god, they're all pouring into my suit! Oh my god! Okay, just what? whatever, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, just stop! Don't wiggle. Holy shit, there's so many of them! <laughs> not like that mattered. I think I had one climbing up on the other side, actually. I was on that side for way too long, so that might have been my fault. Let's try that again. It seemed to be working. I had like eight of them pouring into my suit like fucking tarantulas. Oh my god. I had one crawling on my window the other day. It was very spooky. I suppose a strategy I could use is to not shake them off immediately. Because I believe the wiggling loosens the spring locks. So the less I do it, the better. Hi there. Just gonna let you crawl up for a second while I wind these up. The more the merrier. Just keep crawling on in there. This is really creepy. I'm just letting them into my suit. I'm gonna look over here now. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, yep, see, that's what killed me. I stayed on the left for too long. So I can sort of just kind of watch them pour in. As long as I don't wiggle, then I'm alright, I guess? I don't know. But that mechanic doesn't make any sense. Hi, you're crawling back up again, are you? Can I just check on the left real quick? Hi there. Yeah, okay. Two for one. Yay! All right. Yep. 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 My God! There's so many of them crawling into my suit. Oh my God! That's so freaky. That's even creepier than trying to keep them out, letting them. Oh God! Damn it! Where were you coming from? Ah. Hey, buddy. How you doing? We good? That's good. That's great. Really good. Now get off me. Thank you. Keep on partying on inside my suit. I bet it tickles. <laughs> Can you imagine the guy like trying to wind up the spring locks and the reason why he wiggles is because it tickles? He's like, oh, stop it! Oh, that's my ticklish spot! <laughs> Get up from underneath my armpit, it tickles. Ah! No! There we go, okay. God damn it, sometimes they just won't move. God damn it, shit, shit. Ah! Hey, buddy, party's the other way! Here you come. I feel like there's one on the other side, too. So just give me a moment. Ah! See, that one wasn't even anywhere close. Unless I missed the one on the right. Like, I don't even know what's happening anymore. Like, this is- this is hard, guys. This is actually hard, and it's already been nerfed. Did people beat this before he lowered the difficulty? Because that is talent. For you. That is skill. That way they can find you on the camera. Skill that I obviously do not possess. I think the thing with the ones climbing into the suit is I can't look at them for too long. Like, I can kind of have them off to the side, but I think if my camera pans down too low for too long, then they'll just kind of freak and be like, HE'S LOOKING AT ME, KILL IT! I feel like this level very lacks, severely lacks logic. Because I have to let them come into my suit, but shake off certain ones at the same time, because apparently the ones climbing on the outside of my suit are, of, are a more urgent matter than the ones climbing into my suit. And yeah, the keeping the spring locks wound up is a really cool mechanic. But uh, yeah, the whole mini arena bit, they're freaky. But I mean, they don't make much sense to me at all. And here I am just bitching and moaning about the game. Fuck off. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I have so many spring locks that are loose. I'm dead. 
I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay, 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 okay. Come on, come on, come on. Just wind up. Wind, 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 wind. Okay, do I have one? Yep, I do. Okay, oh my god. Yep, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Look at how many spring locks I have that suck. Yep, that's it. That's it. I'm spending too much side. I'm spending too much time on one side and letting the spring locks on the other side go loose. I had like ten of them all loose at once. So, uh, yeah, that's bad. Yeah, the game doesn't make it clear that you just have to ignore the ones crawling into your freaking suit. I feel like that's cause for panic, but the game's just like, don't worry about it. Just let them give you a little bit of a tickle fight. It's okay. I think if I can just get them up to like the three quarter position, then I'm okay. Like the, the, the one, two o'clock position ish between 12 and three o'clock, then I'm okay. Yeah, just come on in. I don't mind. I'm a party person. Not really at all. Yeah, look at my spring locks. I'm dead. I'm so dead. How did they get loose so quickly? I was just over here! Like, this is bull. Just- uh oh I'm about to die on that one. Okay. Hoofda. Oh, I'm about to die on that one, too. Hoofda! Okay. He's on the other side as well. Like, I'm dead. Oops, wrong buttons. Yep. He was on the other side. Did you- are you seeing the bullshittery that's going on here? If I take too long to wind them up all the way, the other one on the other side kills me. If I decide to sacrifice and get maybe one, two, three o'clock instead, then they loosen too quickly, and then I get spring-locked by mini arenas, apparently. So I- what? Like, this is actually making me mad now. Do you mind? I just shook somebody off, you punk! Get off! Get out of here! God damn it. Yep, there we go. Wait, what? I just shook off two people. There's no way the ones on the sides were up high enough. Maybe the other ones on the other side got too loose. What do you want from me, game? Like, I think it's a certain point. I just kind of have to accept that they're all going to be red. But if they're all red, then I die. See, the fact that it's the same animation no matter how you die, whether it's not wiggling off a mini arena in time or not keeping the spring locks wound up enough, the fact that it's the exact same animation for both is very confusing. Like, because I don't know what's killing me. I mean, sometimes I can make an educated guess, but the rest of the times it's just kind of like, well, I'm dead. I don't know what killed me, but let's just kind of roll with it and try again because I can't tell what killed me and therefore I can't adjust my strategy appropriately. So that's nice. This is literally trial and error with a hint of luck. With a little bit of luck, with a little bit of luck, I'll get past this fucking night for game! Someone's over there, aren't they? Nope, 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 but my spring locks are- oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you shitting me right now? Now what killed me there? Probably the spring locks. See? It doesn't make any sense. What do the mini arenas have to do with me keeping the spring locks wound, besides the fact that I have to wiggle them off like a bunch of assholes? <laughs> It should be a different animation so I know how I'm dying, so I can adjust my strategy. Am I dying to the mini arenas more? Am I dying to the spring locks more? Probably the spring locks, but I can't tell because it's the same death animation! Getting a little angry. A little bit. Whoever managed to beat this before the patch, I applaud you because this is hard enough already. I'm just holding down left click. I'm not even letting go of the button. I think I just thought of a really good title for this episode. It's gonna be called Rage Arenas or something along that line. That's what it's gonna be. This level requires perfection. And I'm a human being, not a goddamn machine, so of course I'm prone to failure and faults. The spring locks wind too slowly, they loosen too quickly when I wiggle. And you throw too many mini 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 blah, 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 at me at once. <laughs> I'll open the face plates for you. After they can find you on the cameras. I liked it better when I didn't know what I was doing and I was dying all the time. I liked that much better. Now I kind of know what I'm doing, and the game's just kind of, you know, punching me in the face with a middle finger. With a really sharp fingernail. That middle finger just goes straight into my eyeball. That's what this game is doing to me right now. I was in water polo in high school, and uh, we weren't professional, obviously. So we didn't have cameras underneath the water. So we had other teams that would, intentionally, they would clip their finger and toenails like you're supposed to, but they would sharpen them 
for the specific reason for, you know, clawing them. Because there was, there was a rule against keeping your fingernails a certain length. There was nothing about how sharp they were supposed to be. So technically what they were doing was legal, but it fucking hurt. Anecdote later. I'm still failing miserably to do this. I'm trying. Guys, I'm, tr I'm, I'm adjusting my strategy. I'm not doing the same thing over and over again. I'm not being an idiot. Am I? <laughs> this game is just stupid. At least the night four is stupid. It was really scary at first. And now I'm just pissed off. So I'm gonna have to reset my webcam, watch through the entirety of the beginning of Night 4 Dialogue again, just to fail for another hour and a half. So, fun. This game's fun. This night's really fun. I'll be right back. Oh my god, you talk more than I do! This is gonna be the first time in recorded Imagination Gaming history I'm gonna need to take five videos to be the main story of a Five Nights at Freddy's game. So. Congrats, Scott Cawthon! Is this what you wanted?! It's a very subtle sound, but I can hear it once they grab me and start climbing up. I can hear them. And it is creepy. This is creepy! Just, it would be a lot more creepy if it was a lot less infuriating and a little more fair. You know, just throwing that out there. I swear, the later I get in, the faster they unwind. That has to be a thing. This, this game. Five Nights at Freddy's fuck you location. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna let myself die over and over again. I'm gonna look up a guide on my phone. So that way I don't have to quit out. Now all guide. you have to do... Hey, can you shut the fuck up? Night 4, aka the nitty gritty? <laughs> I've never heard that phrase before, that's interesting. Hey there, come on up. Don't mind me. Okay, now I'm only focusing on the ones that are blinking. Oh shit, I almost wiggled too quickly. Okay. It's alright, just keep winding. Just a little longer. There, okay. Pretty soon they're all fucking blinking. When the spring lock winds completely, or I just saw it. As soon as it ticked over and got back to the top, that's when I died. So they won't, I just have, to, they're all going to be blinking at some point or another. So that's what they mean by the nine o'clock position. I don't die if too many of them are blinking. I die if one of them makes it all the way around. If, if one completes the full rotation from 12 o'clock to 12 o'clock. So, fuck! Okay, but that, that strategy did seem to work. It's just at the end, I let it get too far away from me by winding up too much. By, like, the fourth wave, I think they said, I just kind of have to accept that they're all going to be red. Like, that's just a thing. So let me just wind up a couple of these. Hey, buddy. And wiggle! Okay. Okay, here comes Mini Arena number one. On the right. Hi. And there you are, number two. Let's just let you guys crawl up. One more. And hiya! Okay. That guide has reinstilled hope in my heart, so thank you. I'm still not seeing any red eyes, unless that's the redness right there, which is constantly going, which is of no indicator to me whatsoever. Just whenever the mini arenas show up again, that's the wave. That's gotta be. Oh shit, I hit- I hit A. I'm an idiot. the Okay, I think- I don't think I got the other one off. I think I'm dead, but I'm not gonna risk it. I don't think I shook enough to get them both off. I think I'm dead. No, she's gone. Okay. Okay. I got this, I got this, I, I got it, I got it, I can do it, I think. Right, here we go. They're all getting red. It's okay though, as long as I keep them away from the 12 o'clock position, then I'm alright. I have a mini arena crawling up on my right, I saw him, her, it, whatever. I Just give me some time, guys. Hi, Lele! Okay. Keep them about nine o'clock. Wait for you to get to the top. Whew, that was close. <gasps> oh, oh, I did it! I think I did it! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> ah! I 
was so close to the end so many times! Oh my god, fuck that! Oh my god, that was so hard! Wow, alright. Vlad and his distressed As mistress. Rises, so popcorn, all of the popcorn. Holy shit! Corn that guy was a lifesaver, whoever wrote that. Thank that you so much. Not my baby. Vlad, you suck. Wait, was that a vampire joke? <laughs> that was so lame, Clara. Like I haven't heard that a million times. Okay, well, how's this? I'm taking the car. The joke's on you. It's a rental. Well, the joke's on you. I set the thermostat to 90 before I left. Good. I like it warm. Good. Because I also set the house on fire. How will it all end? The passion, the tension, the intrigue. <laughs> Tune in tomorrow for the exciting conclusion. Exciting conclusion, huh? Well then, uh, yeah, that was hard. I'm gonna look up that guide right now. Uh, let's see. Mess, uh, no, Safari. Who wrote that? Daddy isn't watching? Is that what, is that what they said? Well, that sucked. Welcome back Nadia Oxford, thank you so much that for that guide. the last day of your first week. Some of the most valued qualities that we like to see in new employees are determination, fearlessness, and a genuine disregard for instinctive self-preservation. Oh, good! <laughs> you earned your one-week bonus, which will be given to you in the form of a delightful gift basket, the cost of which will be taken out of your next paycheck. Wait a minute! Baskets containing fruit, nuts, flowers, and of course, the ever-popular cash basket. Using the keypad below, please enter the first few letters of the gift basket you would like to receive. Um, well, you already docked my paycheck, so cash would be it nice. Seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will autocorrect it for you. Thank you for selecting exotic butters. What? That wasn't even an option! Please be aware that there are still two technicians on Great. site today. Try to avoid interfering with their work if possible. Wait, what? Also, really? feel free to ask them why they are still there and encourage them to go home. Technicians down here. So I'm not alone down here anymore in terms of humans. Interesting. I'm just pushing random buttons. Hello, Earth to the surface! I feel like... This video, this video's already really long. I've been going for like an hour and a half. I feel like I'm gonna be cutting most of it out. I've, I've, all the guides say night four is the hardest part of the game. So I feel like night five will go by relatively smoothly. Maybe a couple tries. Cause I don't know what's coming, but exotic butters. <laughs> okay, I'm all for exotic butters. How many different types of butter there are there anyway? How do you make a whole basket full of assortments of butters? I don't understand that. But anyway, that's the end of this video. I'm sorry I got so mad. But, holy shit. That was an ordeal. But I did it. I didn't cheat. I looked up a guide. But I didn't cheat in terms of going into the code and messing with stuff like the one article said. But, uh, yeah. So, I did it. Kind of. And, uh, thank you again to Nadia Oxford on usgamer.net for that Five Nights at Freddy's Night 4 guide. Because that was a lifesaver and you saved me so much time. So, thank you so much. But anyway, that's the end of this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> like and favorite if you did. Subscribe if you want to see more exotic butters. And I'll see you guys in part number five. Farewell, friends.